These are the scenes that no one can forget. Superstorm Sandy hitting along the coast of the northeast, leaving a destructive path. My immediate family wasn't as affected, but my grandmother's house was totally gutted. It's because of that that the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers have come up with plans to prevent ocean surge from flooding waterfront areas throughout New York and New Jersey. It includes building barriers either in the water or on land and flood walls that would stretch 2,000 square miles. Well, it's nice that the Army Corps of Engineers is working to develop a lot of different plans that can help to protect the entire New York City watershed area. Five plans were unveiled to residents in New York City. It's so important getting feedback from the public and the stakeholders in this region. They know so much intrinsic information, we could never hope to have all that information in there, so, uh, just from our own study. So it's very important to get that, and so that's why we're trying to do these meetings early on. Part of the process calls for building a seawall here along the Hudson River in Lower Manhattan. But some residents we spoke to say they're concerned about the process and how it will affect the wildlife. When they're proposing that kind of massive proposal, they need to do a full environmental impact study and have a better community engagement. The proposal ranges in price, going as high as $30 billion. Engineers hope to narrow it down to just two plans by the end of this year. In New York City for AccuWeather, I'm Kenna Vernon.